let's send a message back to the Alaki of Egba land. Oruko te mini ola yomi koiki. Ori tini la matikoko fagbo. E mini mosobe. Te baro kwenta gbe dani. Chance play lanche. Afe e tra wanyo si leton. Chin chini loku. E mokwe. Wota pas gari. Nibla taba yabo palasi yin. E lo peri lanche. Ati fede bi kon. Oku die ka rilizi e. E bo gwen. E bo gbos. Pe inta gbe dani. Koni di wala. Ba ba la ro ni. Wala yen bo. An so ba yin. En to ba le miye. Ou lo ma duro. En to le miye. E ma bo. Nibla ta ribu yen ba debi to yeko de. E lo mi nwa wan ba yin. Gato sa on to ti soro soke dada. Sheri ti ko soro soke. Ama le kaba kaba. Oru kote mi da de wo. Ola yomi ko iki. Moti sa fun yin. In ron yin. Bukpon nou yin. On lo le bubwa so ko eru. Awa fin to yin le ti ni sepe. Te ba ro pe. E ni kan. E je te te ma alo yin kan yin. Ni to ri pe yin ta an ba yin fa. Ko yin shen kan ke kere. Ama fa de le ni. E yin le ma alo si exal. Ni to ri pe bukpon nou yin. E yin le ron wa lo so ko eru. I kwa nou nyi, e yi le she jamba, fomo yoruba, e yi wan soro, we, kama da ou gonsi le, e yi omo, po gouti wani nou Nigeria, la ti joti Nigeria ti da ye, e yi bo ba ba wiri, e yi bo mwini wini, ni mba taba chwa omo yoruku si le, e yi le le kwa anche, ori bo bo yi la mako kwa fi fwa bon, ya to san woba gidi, to ti soro soke, e lo sofun bo bo an woba, a ti politician, ni intakbe dan yo, ko shere yo, and we are not joking, my name again, is Ola Yomi Koiki. E wo jun ye da da. Konfan. Oman je bo de. Aba yin fa. In ti e minyon ni. Bede le. E ro pe yin ta beda ni. E ro pa fin shere ni. E ro pe kere kere lan she. E bon wini wini. E di a ma a ba wye ne si lo. Boto ba de ste je kon. 30 days. Ni won foun i joba. Bo bo south west. Before 30 days. After 30 days. Before 30 days. After 30 days. A ma bo no a ma yeru koni. A wa lo biko kon. O ju bi ta wa nan ni. A fi to ba jek pe i jata gbe da ni. I jara o la an pa. To ba jek pe in ta gbe da ni. Ko o shek pe le du ma re mwa si. To ba jek pe i jata gbe da ni. Ko o shek pe a fi in sok pe. O mwa yoro bala ti da duro. UK is only 67 million. Wo le ma badu. Ki ya ma jawa ta jek mwa dan 67 million. Ki ya kwa wa ma aso fun ani. La ti palase. Be ka ma dogo si le. O go ti wa ni no Nigeria. Ko so go ni no Nigeria. The governor of Benway State was almost killed today. E se wan so kwe ko so go. E nyo soro. Ni ma to mo Yoruba ti di refugee ni Benway Republic. E ri ba ba madness. A se mba yin falo wani. E wo ju ta wada da o. In te ba ni ke te te beja de. In ta wadon ba ni. A jopo tu wo so ko to konon. Yoruba nation. There's no going back. Have a very good evening. So guys, I see some people... Those who are running after politicians, I see them laughing at these people that they don't know what they're doing. Hmm. They always are illiterate. Hmm. It's just a, a cheap uh, propaganda. Oh, we don't want to go into second slavery. Oh, there's no war. Oh, they are finding embers of war. The question is that when all of these things have been happening, for how long? You know, it, that just shows hypocrisy and, you know, it's baffling. But thank God for those who are still going to be standing because I know a lot of people are watching them to say, oh, don't mind them that, you know, this time time, they'll be tired. Forget them. They are just making noise. They are just doing this, this and that. I saw some of them on social media. They are laughing. They are laughing at, at all these agitators that they don't know what they are doing. They are still queuing behind all these politicians that have brought us to this, to our knees. They don't see anything like that. Some people, like I've always said, some people have purported in their heart that suffering is their, is their watchword, is their motto. So they don't see anything wrong. For somebody who has not even experienced, in Nigeria who has not even experienced uh, three months on disrupted uh, uh, electricity supply, on in that electricity supply, they have not experienced even two, three days. They have not even experienced it. So when you are beginning to tell them it is doable that one month is possible for you to have electricity, one month it is 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 enough for you to say oh there's not going to be any uh, uh, interruption of any kind. They won't believe it because that is not what they are used to. We are used to we are used to potholes. We are used to bad roads. And by the time you just see that they, they just start one you know just small. Uh, uh, road like this everybody will not be happy ah, they tried now they tried now what of if eh, they have not done anything which is not supposed to be and they don't even want you to talk they don't want you to speak and the last thing i really want to say concerning what eh, koiki was talking about do you know that eh, 
in that same year why that same Ogun state this alake is in Ogun state none of the others they want to tell us that they didn't know that uh, some people have really gone they've run to a uh, uh, bene republic to seek for refuge they will behave as if they are not hearing even uh, only of ife or oh, nibia or nibi or ni of ife you will not tell me that he did not hear everybody is carrying it and showing it all over the place they've heard it it's more than it's going to a month that these people have run away from that place they are not refugees and those people are complaining that they want to come back to nigeria because they are they they they, they, they they are not doing anything there their farmland everything they have left there and some people are not seen to all this is they are still telling you it is a propaganda it is a from opposition so it is opposition that is that is not responsible for fulani's that even Buhari himself is even behind the fulani esme I don't I don't just understand. Let us look at everything holistically. The question is that let us even leave the messengers. Let's look at the message. And it is out of wickedness. And we see a lot of them that even came from Ogun State. They are blogging all over the place. But they cannot see. Some people who are even from the Yewa, they are blogging all over the place. They are not saying anything concerning their people. They believe that it is a it is still propaganda. And and there's only one prayer that people will be praying for such people when it gets to them. And unfortunately, these people who are shouting one Yoruba, uh, one nation, one Yoruba nation. They are the ones that will see pity them. They will see talk about their, them. So one thing is that those who know the truth should not relent. Just like these people are uh, are going about this whole thing. And this uh, issue of, uh, oh, there's money, this, uh, okay, all these uh, controversies that we are hearing. Forget, it is normal. Something that is going to be good, you will see a lot of obstacles. So everybody should just forgive each other. For those who are going a battle, oh, uh, they contributed money, my money did not get, forget all those things. Let everything be settled because that is just the tactics of these people. So that there will be confusion in every organization, in every 12, there must always be Judas. People should not just be discouraged because if we continue like this, a lot of people have gone. We don't even know who is next. Those ones who have gone, who have been, who have been killed. They can't be talking of what we are talking about and that is what the evil, evil people wicked people that is just what they want because they believe that how many people go even die people go still remain because leave the messenger and let's focus on the message in that same in that same ogun state the alaki of egba did not talk about uh, those who ran away from his own land from their land no, they didn't say anything but they would tell me, ah sunday Bobo wants to cause war just like he said now these people have taken responsibility on the attack of on, on the attack on governor autumn Fulani guys, they have they have taken responsibility. So what are we going to say? So those ones, they, it is not wahala. It is these people who are talking about a uh, agitation. Who wants? They are not even killing anybody. They just say they want uh, their own nation. Now they become terrorists because definitely before before you know it, they will they will name them, name them terrorists. I don't know why people are like this. Even your own household, they are the ones that will that will speak against you. But all of them. Those who talk about uh, they fought for independence, they fought for what is it called democracy. See all of them now. They have joined the people, the same people they were criticizing. They have joined them. They are doing worse things than even those that they were criticizing before. We all these things are glaring to everybody. Nobody is making it. Everybody knows that these things are happening. Nobody is making it up. It's not as if maybe you are hearing information from somebody or somebody is telling you this is koro koro, this is reality that everybody is seeing. And some people are looking at the other side. They will come and tell you, oh, it is okay, it is okay. Oh, don't say that, it is okay. They will not see all these problems that are all these people who have been causing problems. Like I've always said, so all these Fulani men that are killing people, even anyone, even from your own community, let there be fairness and justice. Those who are perpetrating evil, wherever they come from, whether they are Yoruba, whether they are Igbo wherever they come from if the government is to say go after them and let us see and, and stop all of this rubbish but majority we know that other people are are into this crime but majority of these people who are causing problem who, are, who have already brought war into this country they are full and s-men and they came from elsewhere from another country and joining with the ones you know they've joined hand with the ones that are here if they are taking, if other people are taking like 20%, they are taking 80%. So the tendency to say they are the ones. And if the government is trying to say they are not the ones or their people are saying that, why are you tagging everybody? Let the security agencies, let them do their job and let them and bring them out. And not a selective uh, investigation or arrest. Things are going wrong. People are coming out to tell us, hey, this is this is, this is is not it. And just like you said, all of them, you all of them who are contributing 
to the menace that we are facing in this country all of them will pay they will pay for it so guys let us hear your opinion leave your comment down there below and let us know your thoughts